everybody, Crash Test Bridge here, and today I'm playing an alleged cult classic um, from XGen Studios. It's called Stick RPG. I don't know. Instructions. On event uneventful afternoon, you find yourself drifting off to sleep. <laughs> I like that. Um, your eyes begin to close, but sleep does not come. You find yourself in a state of mind between slumber and, wakeful and wakefulness. The Hino... Gagonic, the high no judge, the the something state. Fuck off, right? <laughs> uh, your sense of spatial dimension. <laughs> I like, I like the, uh, the the play on with words there. And you regain your bearings and become self-aware once more. You come to the dizzying realization that up and down no longer exist. There is no floor, no ceiling. There is no top. There is no bottom. You have entered. For two dimension. <laughs> uh, it looks like you could be stuck here for a while. You may as well en enjoy your new consequence-free environment and all the benefits of megalomania. Acquire as much net worth as you can. To move, use the arrow keys on the keyboard. Enter buildings by walking into the doors. Avoid cars and other obstacles. Um. Right. Many actions, eating, working, will use up time. When you run out of time, return to your apartment to sleep with also restore health. The rest is up to you to explore. Bring it! Um, new game. Still a short one. 15 days. Name. <laughs> Anonymous. Put, got, puts on a Guy Fawkes mask. <laughs> no. Um, crash. Test. Brit. Oh, no! No! Brit man! Right. Charm. 9. Strength. 4. Intelligence. 7. I have extra points? Okay. I would like to play the whole charming aspect of it a bit more, I suppose, than anything. Um, go! It's got a cutscene. I don't know. That sounds painful. Um, right. Directional buttons. Avoiding cars. Can you talk to people? Oh, when you move, all the quality kind of decreases. <laughs> right. Um, let's just have a look around then. Oh, God, that's confusing. Um, what would you like to do? Check messages? Okay, mm hi, it's... <laughs> <laughs> I'd sound like one for a second. Okay, mm hi, it's Richard from McSticks calling. Yeah, okay. Mm I'm calling for you because you got the job. Right. So you could just come in and start whenever. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> bye bye. Um, sleep. Save. Game saved. Hopefully, this means I can come back to it if I like it then. Um, let's just have a look around. Fine. Fine. Furnishings. Okay. And um, that's my stick. Yeah. Let's go in here. Welcome to my sticks. May I take your order? Work slash cook for like six dollars an hour. Oh, right. So it's not actual like activity. You just waste the time to. Oh, I can't select it. Right, I'm leaving. Um. Um. God, I can't read anything. No one to draw the line with a little booze, <laughs> little advert there. Ooh, casino. That's kind of shiny. What else is here? Pawn shop. Ho ho ho! If you know what I'm. <laughs> no. Um. What else? Like caravan park, bus depot. Okay, so you can fall off the edge of the world. I didn't realise. I thought it would just stop you. I thought I'd give it a try, you know? Um. Oh, shit. This is actually quite a comfortable setup. I did kind of knock it to start with. It's like, oh my god, I'm wearing two headsets, but it's actually quite comfy and amusing. I might just stick with the setup, to be honest. Uh, new Lines Incorporated. I don't know. Bank. My god, this game is going way over my head. Uh. Uh, okay. So you can get real estate and shit. Let's just 
just deposit 100, I suppose. Don't know what the point in that is. Current interest rate compounded daily, so you get 3. Point, I'll get 3.2% interest on that. Do you know, if only bank interest was that was that good in real life on a current account. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. Um, New Lines Incorporated. Yes, I did just talk technical bank stuff. <laughs> Leave me alone. Um, let's go in here. I suppose the whole point is just to explore. Hello. <laughs> Hello, I'm sticky. What's your poison, mate? Drink beer. You get two, plus two charm for it. I suppose, in a sense, it works opposite to Oblivion and Skyrim. <laughs> um, buy a bottle of beer. Play drunken darts. Or get into a bar fight. So, really, the idea is just to do whatever the fuck you want and live your life how you want to. So, there's no actual objective? Huh. Welcome to Silver Lining Casino. How can we empty your pocket? <laughs> Play blackjack, maybe? Um, I've completely forgotten the rules of blackjack. Alright, bet five. Deal. Hit me! Oh, of course, you need to make sure it doesn't hit... You need to make sure it doesn't go over 21. Um, so that's... Stand or hit me. Stand. Dealer bust! Okay. I think I just won. <laughs> God, that was confusing. Um, queen and ace. I've forgotten how many that counts for. I've... Oh, I should have bet something on that. I'm leaving. <laughs> ah, it's kind of confusing. <laughs> um, I should really freshen up on my blackjack rules a little. It's been ages since I've played it. I for I've forgotten what each. Oh my god, really? You could get like knives and guns and stuff and run around killing people. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh no! Uh, uh, just when I thought this was a carefree game with no action in it. What's in here? Oh, it's like a snack bar. Cool. <laughs> Give me a pack of smokes. Welcome to the fucky town. If I have a convenience store where I can be serving up some quality product for you, be getting your drink on and getting your snack on. How can I hook your brother? How can I hook a brother up? Um, uh, I don't know. Grab me a slushy. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> no busting caps. <laughs> This game's got a bit of a charm to it, actually. I was a bit like, what the fuck do I do to start with? Um, oh, yeah, I quite like it, actually, to be honest. New Lines and Cop, what is in here? Hi, welcome to New Lines and Corporate. How can I help you today? Apply for a job? Before applying, unfortunately, failed the aptitude test. You need 20 intelligence. I think I saw a school. Maybe that can increase my intelligence? Oh, it's, it's a uni university of stick. Um, study, which is plus one intelligence. Go to the class, which is t plus two, but it costs. And go to the gym, plus one. What are my stats? Let's have a look. Intelligence 11. I need to work on that. Job title, McSlip. <laughs> wow, that kind of sums up your job at McDonald's in one, doesn't it, really? <laughs> You're a McSlave. Oh dear. Um, net worth. Uh, game length, music on, optimize on. Is that the whole thing where it kind of... Show frames per second. I don't need to know that shit. Um, let's study. Ah, oh, I think I'm out of time. Let's go to the hotel and sleep. This is a very in-depth game. I wonder who actually thought it up. I will leave a link in the description, as always, if you want to give it a go. I uh, just found it on XGen Studios. I think it was made actually for XGen. So, um, let's sleep. 9 HP restored. <laughs> for when I fell out of the world like an idiot. Um, save it. Previous game overwritten. Fantastic. I like it when that happens. Um, let's take a look in the furnishings. 
Oh, right, so you buy a new bed, and you get even more HP heals. That's fine. Uh, appliances, electronics... Oh, God, I can't go to appliances and electronics. Help me! Help me, someone! Um, I suppose I should get some more intelligence to get a better paid job. Because six dollars an hour probably isn't going to cut it when a lot of the stuff in this game costs a bomb. Um, so, yay, intelligence increased. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 18. Awesome. Right. So, um, when the when it's just about the end of the day, you need to go to sleep. I am um, quite liking this, to be honest. It's like Second Life, but not stupid. <laughs> um. Yeah. Okay. Uh, save the game. Let's roll. Ah, mouse, get off my screen. Sorry, I need, to keep an, I need to keep keeping an eye on my laptop. It seems to want to shut down every 15 minutes, and it's like, no, don't do it. Um, hmm. Fuck it, do some work. Be useful. Um. Oh, okay, so for working an almost full day, I actually can get, like, a nice big solid amount of cash. Fair enough. Um, what's in here? Oh, I've already been... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I've already been in there. That was my fu- That was my funky brother. From another mother. I've not been in the pawn shop yet. Oh, yes, I have. I wonder if the alarm clock means you can wake up earlier. Might be a good idea to invest in actually if I'm going to be getting this new job. I wonder if the mechanics are worked in there. It's like, oh, you're late! Um. Yay! Oh, do you know, I'm one away. <gasps> right, I'm overworked. I, um. I need to go and sleep now. Well, that means I can apply for the job. Awesome. I think I'm going to spend the, um, the next day getting more money. So that I can, uh, so that I can get an alarm clock. So it's just, um, actually no, I have enough money in the bank already. I forgot about that. So let's go take a look and draw out some funds. Bank balance. So in the t so in the four days I've been here, it's gone up about nine dollars. <laughs> Dear me. Um, do a quick math. Uh, Seventy-two. Thank you. Alright, head in here. Alarm clock. Woohoo! I don't know what use for cell phone I'd possibly have. I suppose we'll find out at some point. I should probably... Oh! Go on and... Um, is there a way you could, like, place something in your hotel room, or is it just going to be, like, automatic? I'll finish off this day, and then I really need to finish. I think it's just automatic. Just go, just go work some more money. Work some more money? Get some more money. Hiya! He and my awesome powers. And then for the remaining bit of the day, I'm just going to go into the university and work out. <laughs> Good look at that body. <laughs> I work out. <laughs> so it's um ah right, and it increases your HP as well. Awesome. Wow, this is a pretty well thought out game, if I'm going to be honest. They brought, they brought out a sequel, uh, Stick RPG 2. So, um, yeah, awesome. What I'm probably going to do then, um, now it's day 5. I did just save it, so that's fine. I'm going to end it here. So, um, God, all my videos nowadays seem to be so long. Sorry, I don't do it on purpose. So, um, yeah, I'm probably going to play this again at a later point if you guys want. Remember to like the video if you liked it, and uh, please do comment. I do like to have conversations with my viewers in the comments boxes. Uh, so, um, yeah, thank you very much for um, for watching, and um, 
I'll see you tomorrow with more Spyro. Toodles!